Uh, it's been a, it's been a long road, but it's it's been great. And uh, we all know what's meant what's meant to be in life is is meant to be. Oh, I forgot to thank Kerry Davis and the whole HBO staff. But um, I'm truly truly blessed, and uh, hard hard work and dedication pays off. Uh, when you guys see me on 24 7 you guys think I'm just joking and but um I gave the sport of boxing my whole life uh 30 years uh just to get to this point and um Ricky Hatton has he's been in some tough fights he's he's, he's a pretty com competitive fighter but he hasn't been in there with a guy like me Floyd Mayweather I can adapt and, and adjust to any style at any weight um, I've been, I think he turned professional in 97. I turned pro around 97. It took me one year to become world champion. I'm world champion to this day. And then it, some try to say I'm the bigger man in this fight. It really doesn't matter. Skills pays the bills, so it really don't matter who's the bigger man. I want to thank the media, everybody who wrote articles about me, uh, from the positive articles to the, to the negative articles, uh, as long as you wrote about me. Uh, the Mayweather name is, is here to live on. Yeah, but it, it's been, everybody that's up here in the front has played a part, and I truly appreciate it. Even Ricky Hatton, Oscar De La Hoy, um, Bernard Hopkins, uh, one hell of a fighter. And um, Bernard and Oscar are two hell of a fighters that's in my era. And uh, it's, it's great just to be sharing the stage with Oscar, Bernard and Ricky. And um, I'm going to continue to uh, beat the best that they put in front of me. And um, uh, this is Mayweather Promotions' uh, first show. Um, we got to start off small first before we uh, talk about moving on big like Golden Boy. Uh, you got to crawl before you walk. So we're taking our time. And, and I know what it takes. I've uh, been there before. 18, 19 championship fights. Um, fought every style. From, I fought the best from Africa, the best Africa had to offer, uh, the best Mexico had to offer, the best LA had to offer, and uh, now I guess this is the best that Britain has to offer. Um, Billy Graham was right when he said that Ricky Hatton is the best from Britain. He's right, he is the best in Britain, but I'm the best fighter in the world. And there's two different levels. You have, you have C level fighters, you have B level fighters, you have A level fighters. Um, you see me dominate A-level fighters with, with ease, plenty of times. So, uh, December 8th, you guys can't miss this. The fight the fight didn't sell out for 30 minutes uh, for no reason. It's a reason why it sold out in 30 minutes. And um, I just want to continue to uh, keep beating the best that they put in front of me. And, you know, I, I thank God for everybody just coming out, supporting me and Ricky Hatton, all the um, photographers, to, to all the, uh, the news channels. It's truly a blessing just to be where I'm at. Thank you. Hey, one, one thing. Uh, I, must, I, must, I must confess and come to this, though. I got to tell the truth. Ricky Hatton took your suit. He got your suit. No. <laughs> I got him, y'all. <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs>